Uh, I'm Luke Fowler from the Genie Meta Operations Center project at Indiana University. Uh, we're looking at operational procedures and data sharing for the Genie project. Uh, so what we have here is a uh, multi-touch display, which is a, a prototype of our uh, Genie Meta Operations Center portal software. Um, what we're showing here is an aggregate view of all of the clusters on Genie that we have data about. So um, the blue lines are showing the Proto Genie cluster. Um, there are uh, links between uh, Salt Lake City um, all the way down to Washington, D.C. Um, and then these other lines are showing the uh, NLR network that's supporting a demo cluster um, that we're using in our demo here today. So this portal is designed to allow you to uh, view various statistics about the Genie uh, infrastructure, what's operating, what's up, what's down. Um, for instance, if we zoom in on one of these nodes here, we can see uh, UT Dallas's Planet Lab nodes, uh, these are green. That shows that both of the Planet Lab nodes in this location happen to be up at, the at this time. Click here and get a list of the nodes. Um, notice that some of these other ones are yellow and red. Uh, the yellow ones indicate that the uh, node is currently half up, so there's one or more uh, nodes in this location that the reporting is up. Uh, red means the nodes in the location are reporting is down. Uh, we can do a few things here, like uh, instead of looking at nodes, we can look at slices. Uh, so this is a view of all the active slices that we have data about now. We click on one of these, and we should be able to see the set of nodes that are um, available in this particular slice. So it looks like, oops, looks like we have a few nodes in the United States here that are uh, that are a member of this slice. Uh, we can also click down here at the bottom and get some additional data. So this is an aggregate set of statistics for the slice. Um, we're looking at 15-minute receive and transmit traffic. Um, in addition to the uh, aggregate statistics, we can also get per node, per slice statistics. Now if we go back here to the node list, uh, here we have a, a list of all the nodes in, in this particular slice, and we can click on one of these uh, and get data for just this particular node. Uh, so this is the per slice, per node view. Uh, in addition to the geographic representation, uh, we do have a logical representation. Uh, not too interesting on this slice because we don't have any uh, connectivity between the nodes to show. Uh, this is just an alternate view of that same data. Uh, we do have the capability here of switching between clusters, so we're, go we're sh showing all here. We can switch and say, just show Planet Lab, um, and we'll go back to nodes. And here we have a similar picture, but you notice that all of the tubes that we were showing before are gone, and we're just showing all the Planet Lab nodes in this case. Uh, we'll do the same thing, switch to Pro Protogenie. You can see we just have their circuits now, or go back to all, uh, and we'll load the data for the whole network. So uh, this is based on the Google Earth plugin um, and some custom code that we've written uh, at GMOC to, to integrate Genie data into this. Um, basically what you're seeing on the outside here is all a web browser, Firefox, uh, Google Earth plugin on the internal piece, and we're using JavaScript events to communicate between the browser and the plugin. Uh, the goal over the next uh, six months is to expand this with data from more Genie projects and um, to uh, extend usability. Um, after this demo session, this will be available on the web, uh, and there'll be a link posted to this tool on the GMAC uh, Genie Wiki page if you'd like to check this out.